Hey, hey guys, um, I don't usually listen to any country. I usually listen to like hip hop or rap or rock. And uh, I listen to some K pop. And my wife is like, you need to try out some some country. I was like, well, like the only stuff I really listened to is like growing up as a kid. I remember my grandma and my, my dad listening to Conway Twitty. That was about that was about it. I never really got into any of the mainstream uh, country music. I was like, okay, well, I've kind of heard Tennessee Whiskey before. Always sound like a good song. So I was like, well, let me see uh, Chris Stapleton doing it live. Let's let's check it out. <laughs> I like that bulb from the lights in the back. Used to spend my nights out of the barroom. Liquor was the only love I'd known. You can sing. You can sing. But you rescued me from reaching for the bottom. All right, all right. As a normally a country hater, if every song had the like feeling, I, I would be a country fan. There's a lot of feeling. There's a lot of feeling even in that guitar. There's a lot of feeling even in 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 that bass. The guy playing the bass. Uh, all right, all right. Let's check it. Let's check it. Tennessee whiskey. Mm, got some mood. Mm. Ooh, nice change up. Ooh, ooh, that's a nice change up right there. So this is in Austin city limits. Oh man, especially how it's been the last couple years. Like COVID and other stuff. Could you imagine sitting there? It's a beautiful stage, beautiful lighting in the background here. I love how they have it. And just the, this is 2018 I'm looking at. Just that, it's, it's moodiness, it's, it's sarcasm, it's, sarcasm's not even the right term. I just, um, man, I, I, I don't know. It, it hits you. I don't know. Maybe because watching a live performance and how things have gone, it just kind of hits me different right now. It's kind of hitting me different. Just how it's going. Cause there's nothing like your love to give me. Smooth as you're as sweet strawberry wine. Hmm. This is the first time I'm listening to the lyrics. As a glass of brandy, honey, I stay strong on your love all the time.
See, I'm a terrible musician. I was, I was kicked out of bands throughout my life, okay? <laughs> I've played many instruments. People I would get in based on my personality, and I would always be kicked out. <laughs> but right here, what, I want, what I'm trying to, what I want to say is like, it's not about the speed. It's not about the like necessary accuracy. It's sometimes like having the most simple notes that like, it's kind of like, let's say when you're writing, right, and you wrote an entire page of stuff but like the best information is with is if you cut that down and put it in four lines like that's what these kind of guitar this kind of guitar solo is it it cuts out the fluff it's it's only the notes that really make it now i might that, that might sound really dumb that's just how i feel about it I really love his voice. I never really like stopped and listened to him before. Who she was. Oh, look right here. The fact that he's literally singing to his wife who's singing with him on stage. I don't care what genre you listen to. This is a classic. Yeah, I mentioned. Okay, I'm glad that it was one of the comments because what I was looking at was like for a lot of this, his eyes end up going this was going this way on stage, and her eyes were like coming over and i was like oh this is this is getting a little like like intense <laughs> you know what i'm saying like oh i didn't know he was singing to his oh he's singing with his wife wow that made it like a lot more like wow So it was just as. Oof. Oof. You see when his eye, like when his eyes go from the guitar, he went and looked straight at her. That's what I was like picking up on. I was like, this is, this seems like a little more just intimate than like, I don't know what I was like initially, like I was picking up on it, but I didn't understand, you know, I was like, is he just a really good perf performance and he's playing with his lady? Wow. That really. That really took me back. That took me up, took me up back. Beautiful voice. That was really good. I love the guitars in there. Loved everything about that. Actually, I'm not sure what else to listen to from him. I'm totally unfamiliar. But uh, if you like this content and you want to see more of this, uh, let me know. Please subscribe. And if you want to hang out with me, I'm always live over on Twitch TV slash Mister Incredible. Last eyes, two eyes. I'm floored right now. <laughs>